Security has been beefed in the Gambia. The country's security forces have taken over the headquarters of the Electoral Commission. They instructed its chairman to leave and have since barred other employees from entering. The only thing we are doing is to keep the peace and stability of this country. Okay, mm -hmm. okay. Are you worried that there might be demonstrations? No, 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 no. no. We, are, well, why we are all are, Gambians. Why should we worry about demonstrations? Why are there extra soldiers on each street yeah, corner? The extra soldiers is to ensure and give the people the assurance that there is peace and stability. And that's all. The takeover happened during a visit by West African heads of state. The leaders from Nigeria, Ghana, Liberia and Sierra Leone are here to try convince Gambia's longtime ruler, Yaya Jameh, to relinquish power. But it's going to take time to get him to respect the will of the people. Was he receptive to you? Pardon? Was he receptive to you? Oh, very much so. Very much so. What did he say? Jame lost the elections to opponent Adama Barrow. After conceding defeat, he then changed his mind. Gambia's president officially has 60 days to hand over power, but he is adamant to contest the results at the country's Supreme Court. Well, even though there were some issues about um, people who are not allowed to vote, but we told them as far as we are concerned, anybody whose name is registered is allowed to vote. And um, the result as they are still stands. And the only recourse, of course, when you have any problem with the uh, results of the election, one has to appeal to the Supreme Court. Mm -hmm. And the Supreme Court has been governed since May 2015. Legal experts believe that at least four new judges would need to be hired to hear his petition. With Gambian judges no longer willing to serve on the Supreme Court, foreign judges have increasingly been brought in to hear cases. The current Chief Justice is from Nigeria. Tuli Shabalala, CCTV.